Welcome to the channel folks. Today got a little little goodie here I want to check out and bring you along with me. Uh, this is called the Amalm Live. It's a six inch pole saw and a chainsaw. We're going to open this box. I've already opened it and charged the battery. I wanted to make sure it was full. But other than that, I have not done much to it. So. Let me come bring you with me here. And show you what all is in this box. Alright, here's a better view uh, of what we got. Comes with the actual 6 inch chainsaw brushless uh, I believe this has a 21 volt uh, 3 hour amp battery uh, that's surprising uh, it, it feels pretty quality just holding it you know at first glance okay we got that comes with a pair of safety glasses uh, you always want to wear these when you're cutting limbs above your head because you're going to get stuff in your eye. And uh, that's a pretty cool looking pair. And we got a little bag. Look at there. An extra chain. Well, you don't see that every day. It's a little brush. A file to sharpen it. A wrench. That's to adjust the uh, blade. Or the chain, I'm sorry. And a little screwdriver. And we've got the charger for the battery. I've already used that. And the battery. Get that dude out of there. Looks pretty much like a DeWalt battery. 21 volt. It's got a strap. Hope you hold the pole saw. And the actual pole. Right, let's take a look. Let's put the battery on this dude. Then we'll get it all put together. I've got to get some uh, bar oil to put in here. I do like that feature. Some of them don't have this. you got to manually oil the chain, which sucks. This you fill up with this little uh, cup there, and then you prime. Use this primer bulb to oil your chain. I imagine probably while it's running. It has a safety button on it. Okay, and let's get this uh, puppy going. I have one over this paper they put with it. I don't know what those are. I, I don't read those. But anyway, it's pretty cool. Let's get this dude put together, see what it'll do. All right, let's see what this puppy will do. Now, these levers you unhook. And extend it out. Lock it back. And we're gonna about need all of it. That's quite a quite a big reach. Okay. Let's go there. Oh yeah. Let's saw on that puppy there. And use it. <laughs> Just got to get the feel for it, that's all. I don't want to cut too many limbs down because that, that equals work, man. Watch it. You just, has a little foam on there you got to rest. All right, let's cut this bigger one down. Let's see what I'm doing. There we go. There's a little point there. There you have it. Pretty cool. <laughs> now you know why you gotta wear safety glasses. Yeah, look at my shirt. That stuff comes right down on you, man. All right, so we know it cuts limbs that are high. Now let's take this dude off, put it back down. Uh, where did I see that thing? When I rested that against the limb and just kind of let the saw do the work, it worked a lot better so, than what I originally did. Alright. 
All right, I've detached the saw from the pole. And let's just see. Get you in there. Pretty nifty, man. Now these aren't professional, you know, saws you're going to use every single day. This is for your average homeowner uh, going out doing a little spring cleanup in the yard, cutting limbs. Uh, I'm impressed. I'm very impressed with it. And it takes about two hours to charge a battery. Uh, I don't even think it took quite that yesterday. And uh, it's supposed to have a hour, one hour use time. So. Yeah, it's going to make quick work of stuff. You don't have to hear a loud motor. Uh, it's pretty handy. Pretty handy. All right. All right, so these together, you know, you doesn't take up much room in your shed or your garage. You can store them real easy when you need it. If you just need this, you know, to help chop up a little firewood for your wood stove, this is perfect. And I actually have a still battery-powered uh, I think it's probably a 14 inch or 12 inch uh, bar and chain but that's too much for little things to make kindling out of and, you know it's a good pruner and uh, the name of the brand is it's hard to pronounce Imoum I-M-O-U-M Imoum I guess I can take these off now I bet I look cool in them though but anyway yeah uh, it is a pretty cool product, but you want to hear the best part? You get everything you saw here on Amazon right now for $169. Man, you can't beat that. That's a very good price. Uh, this just feels quality, you know. Pretty, pretty tough, durable plastic. And this is no joke either. This thing's pretty, you know, pretty well made. Uh, I'm impressed. You know, it's something I will use around here a lot. So guys, I just wanted to show you this. Uh, I think the folks at the Malm, in Malm, why don't companies name stuff easy? Like the Fred, you know, or, or the sandwich. I could remember that. But it's a good product. Uh, I'm gonna put a link in the description. Y'all wanna purchase this? Uh, I'm not making anything on it. I got the saw, you know, they gifted me the saw to do a review. I don't do many reviews, but if it's a product I know I can use, then then I'm happy to do them. You know, it's a it's a no. Uh, everybody wins. All right, guys, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, go ahead and subscribe. Hit the like. Hit the unlike. I don't care. Happy trails. And I forgot to attach the. It's a safety guard for the top of the chain so you don't accidentally, you know, run your hand or your leg or something on top of that. And uh, <laughs> you want to pull the battery out before you install that. You know, it even it has, it has the safety buttons, but why take a chance? So I removed the battery, then I installed that. But I did not have this on uh, when I did the review. But it is was in the bag with the tools and uh it's something especially if you've got kids around you know they're gonna see something like this and go hey man that's cool let's go play lumberjack well you know they shouldn't have them in the first place but if that happened you need to have the safety guard on so i just wanted to put that on there as well all right happy trails